Hello everyone, welcome back. More look be a landlord. Uh, still no mods because I've actually really enjoyed the last two videos that we've... Oh, I'm on infinite speeds. Um, because I've actually really enjoyed the last two videos that we've made on this. Um, so I just kind of want to chill on the vanilla game for a bit. And I know that might not be to everybody's uh, interest, you know. But I've been enjoying it and I think I'm going to play it for a little bit more maybe until... Maybe until I feel the need to add um, some mods. It won't be too long. It'll only be a couple of days, I think. I just, I'm enjoying it right now. I've had some good runs. I like getting these guillotine essence runs, you know, playing for an hour, seeing how far we can get in an hour. I, I really do quite like it. So I'm just going to carry on for a bit, you know. At the end of the day, I am here to try and get uh, a lot of the achievements complete. Oh, look at that. Two in a row. Two in a row. Yes, come on. Give me another one. Oh, okay, no worries. We've got a key though, so I'll add the lockbox. Um, thanks for all your support on the videos recently, guys. We've been back on about three days now, and I'm loving it. I'm genuinely loving it. Uh, feels better than ever, and I think a large portion of that is because I'm playing. Oh, look at that. Coconut followed by Oswald. Just need a monkey now. Um, yeah, I think part of that is because I'm trying new games on the channel, and I'm going back to old games, and I'm just trying different things. And I'm really enjoying it. So I'm going to try and do it. Uh, so I'm going to say it's the start of the episode where more of you are here. Because I know people click off videos later on. It's just how it works. Um, if you've got any games that you want me to play. Any games that you want me to go back to. Anything like that. Let me know. Uh, preferably new games. Unless there's a game on the channel that you want me to go back to. Like Bloons. Which I think I am going to go back to. Relatively soon. Maybe to No, not today. i got planned stuff for today. We'll have to see. Uh, but yeah, just let me know because I'm going to be playing a bunch more. Are oh, we doing okay? Man. We paid 100, 125 spare. I'll take a die. I can't do a cat run again, but cat items are so good. They're so good. Um, so yeah, just let me know. And um, I do plan on just playing a bunch of different games, you know, trying to spice up a bit. Obviously, I prefer if they're like roguelikes, indie games, you know, single player like adventure games and stuff like that don't really work well for YouTube. Um, but yeah, I'm just, I'm excited, man. I just, I love, I love the era that we're in right now, even though this era of APQ is only a few days old. Uh, I fully plan on just going crazy. I need to add some symbols. I think as soon as I get like a backlog of videos sorted out, my plan is to have like a few series like pre-recorded. Like oh, Isaac's a really easy one to pre-record. Um, that's probably about it. What else is really easy to pre-record? I, I don't know. Um, there, there'll be a few things, right? They'll be really easy to record. And my, my thinking is to just like... No, we'll skip those. Um, if I can get like a few of those things... Hello. Pre-recorded, right? And I can get like a week ahead on videos. And I can start streaming in the evening. And then streaming... I say in the evening. Obviously, everything I do is in the evening. Because that's the only free time I have. If I have any at all. Which is another reason why I want to pre-record. But if I get a week's videos in advance, I can start streaming in the evenings. In the late evenings. And then when I do that, I can then help. I can turn a few of the streams into videos maybe. And then that will help with the amount of videos. And then we can have like a nice cycle where I have enough content and I have enough time to stream and still record a few. Do you know what I mean? Might sound absolutely insane because I feel like I have just waffled for a good five minutes. But that's where that's where I want to get to. So that's what I'm working towards, I think. And I think I like that. Oh, the gambler's gone. I've just removed a symbol. God damn it. Um, so yeah, that's, that's what I'm planning. I just need time to be able to pre-record stuff. Because uh, obviously, pre I, at the minute, I record everything on the same day it comes out. I, I literally don't pre-record anything. So that's an issue. Um, hopefully we can sort. I'll take rerolls. We've got a die on the board somewhere. And it re-rolled a one, okay. Right, never mind. Um we're on 20 symbols. I can't really remove anything. I don't know what kind of build we're gonna try and go for today. I'm just gonna let it happen, I think, and we'll just see. Um we'll see what essences we get, you know. We'll see what items we get. Might get some good rare items that kind of take us places. I can already see where it's going though. <laughs> I can already see where it's going. Um not sure if this is something that I really want to do, but if you if you got like a bunch of anthropology degree essences and rusty gear essences, 
then you could do the billion the billion dollar run with this i need a monkey i've got coconuts and oswald nice eats coconut half straight away um this could easily be a billion dollar run you know so just takes a bit of time to get anthropology degree essence and rusty gear essence over and over and over again we've been quite lucky in the latest two videos i'll take it but i doubt we'll get anywhere near it um yeah, we've been quite lucky in the recent oh i'm gonna have to do it um sorry we'll take corner of the string i've been quite lucky that oh, i meant to cancel that or oh, turn that off I, i've been lucky in the recent videos where we've had popsicle and stuff quite early on i think yesterday i had did i have telescope and popsicle really early or was it tele yeah i think i did so you know i'm a little bit lucky in that sense i'm going to disable black cat in fact i'm not going to disable black cat because when are we ever going to get 13 cats I need oysters now, I think. I think that's my plan. Because I haven't done the geologist build in what feels like forever. So I'm completely down for that. I don't really want a miner, although it does kind of work with a geologist. I'll add a bear, though, so I quite like bears. I'll just replace it for something else in a bit. Got to get rid of the flower, the bee, the pearl. And I was going to go suits. That's why I added a black spade at the start, but I haven't seen any more. So I think I'm going to remove that as well. Uh, and that bounty hunter. And I say that as I find another club. Um, but no, it's fine. I'm excited, man. Oh, I just want to play games. I just want to play games. That's all I want to do. Okay. Golden arrow points to a jellyfish. Nice one. Not that I really care for the jellyfish. Just give me another cultist. Bruh. The cultist is just going to be... I mean, it already is the staple of this entire YouTube channel. I've done that many cultist runs. It's my favorite symbol in the game. If this isn't an ode to yesterday, I don't know. It's throwing me cat items, but I have to go rusty gear, and I'm sorry. But it is throwing me cat items. Let's get rid of the... Oh, I've just got rid of the pearl. Bro, the geologist can literally eat the pearl, and I've just removed the pearl. Okay. Okay, I'm throwing. Let's, let's focus up here. I'm messing about. I need to focus up. I'm too busy talking to you guys. You're distracting me. I'm waffling. I don't want any of those. Okay. I do want a dwarf because we've got happy hour essence. Yeah, I want a dwarf. Nice. You got rid of the sapphire, of course. You can do that as well. We can add any ore. I'm going to add beer because happy hour essence is there. But that's a risk, actually, because there isn't even a dwarf on the board yet. It's okay. The bee's got to go. The flower's got to go. The bounty hunter's going to go. I've just... I've just re-rolled an oyster. What am I doing? Focus up APQ. We're better than this. Come on. <laughs> right. I'm sorry. This is it. I'm going full game mode now. Uh, cultist added. I'm going to remove the... Your two values. So I'm not going to get rid of you yet. I'm going to get rid of the dog. Okay. Still loads more to remove. The black suit's going to go next, I think. We pay 450 with 600 spare. We actually are doing really well. Listen. It's got to be done. That's what we're here for. <laughs> We're going to take Comfy Pillow Essence as well. And I'm actually also going to take Wine. Um, we're going to take Rain Cloud. Sure. Uh, actually, I'm going to use this to help me find a... Uh, am I going to use this to help me find a rare... There's the Dwarf. Yeah, very rare item I am. That's, that's worth it. I know I probably shouldn't because I want to obviously keep all the Essences. But we're not at the point in the game to... Disable all the essences, really. There's an oyster, everybody. I've added one. Let's go. Okay, happy hour essence has been activated as well, which is nice. We've got a hooligan somewhere, so I'm fine with adding a big urn. Okay, 103 rolled. Coconut for the monkey. He's still on the board somewhere. This has got to go. The flower's got to go. The bee's got to go. Or can be added, of course, for our geologist. Then we just want more oysters, really, as the course of the run goes on. And I guess... Is there any essences that really benefit an arc? Uh, oh my god, I could have been an archaeologist. Uh, a geologist? Oh, comfy pillow essence. We're going to pay this to get a very rare item. I will take a bartender because we've got what we've got. Uh, no way it's giving me an ancient lizard blade. I hate this item. I mean, I take it anyway, but I hate it still. Okay, the black suit's going to go. Okay, so... The flower and the bee are going to go next. I don't need any more flowers. 
Nice. Three stacks on this geologist. I don't think there is a legitimate way of what I don't think I don't think any essence is buff the geologist. I guess the only thing that would be would be anthropology degree essence. In which case we would need eight people on the board, so we might have to actually keep the cultists for this run. Oh no, this could be not great. I don't think we're going to get to a billion with this kind of run. <laughs> to be honest. It's okay. Uh, another... Oh, bro. I might get to a billion if I use the cultists, though. Maybe today isn't a geologist kind of day. <laughs> There's another oyster. Okay, nice. There we go. I've officially rolled past... Or not rolled past two oysters now. I mean, I've rolled past a few oysters as well, but... It's okay. Need the geologist to eat some of these things up, though, for us. Okay, flower and the bee. I need removal tokens, please, if possible. We'll pay 625 with 895 spare. We have actually smashed it, haven't we? I'm going to add capsule machine. I'm going to add lucky cat essence. Uh, do I want to reroll here? I don't know what I want if I am going to reroll. I'm doing it anyway. Do I, want, I haven't got a key. I don't want a treasure chest. Silver arrow, not really. I could add another bartender. Try and make it a more beveragey build. I will take golden carrot. Okay. I could go more beveragey, couldn't I? I could. I just need to see how it plays out. I need to get rid of a few more symbols. Get a board of like 20 symbols and then we'll just see. I think the way it's going right now, cultists are in the lead, but... I think the most money we're going to get may be from Happy Hour Essence, Dwarven Anvil Essences, and a bunch of beverages. But even then, they're not going to be great, you know, numbers. Oh, that was Capsule Machine Essence. Well, at least it gave me free removal tokens. Let's get rid of the Flower, the Bee, and what else did I say? The Bounty Hunter. Okay. We'll let this guy eat his coconuts, and then we'll see where we're at numbers-wise. Um, no way. I, you know, I'm taking it. I'm taking a second golden arrow. Turns a jellyfish into a 32 value symbol, so I kind of have to. I'm definitely taking a mine that adds ore, and of course the geologist eats ore, and it eats the things that the ore turns into, so it's just a win-win. Uh, item capsule, what are you going to give me? Tortoise and the hare. Okay, nice. I do actually need to do a moon rabbit build now that we've done a sunflower build as well, so that is on the list. Time capsule should add, hopefully, something that the geologist can engulf. Okay. Nice. Second chemical seven as well. Golden arrow points to nothing amazing. I guess, I don't know how I want to, I don't know where this build's going. I keep trying to think in my head, oh, maybe that would be good. Maybe that would be good. But I don't know what to do. Beehive bear, maybe. A second geologist. I don't think it's worth it. I've got a bear on the board though, so I will add honey just for like, you know, a little bit of banter or whatever. Mining pick gives us a bit of gold whenever ore is destroyed. I've got another removal token. What do I remove? Another chemical seven, that'd be our third one. What do we actually remove here? One of these hooligans. Yeah. Okay. Get rid of the jellyfish next, I think as well. That gives me a removal token back. So maybe I should have done that first. Yeah. And then got rid of the hooligan. Um... Okay. 101. I don't want any more of these. Especially no more jellyfish. Okay, 84. Um, I guess just another chemical 7. I'm at a point. Oh, I got an achievement unlocked. I didn't notice. Mine. Okay, that's good. That works then. That was worth getting, I guess. We got an achievement today without trying once again. A golem that adds ores as well. We are stacking this guy up, but I don't think I'm going to keep him around for too long. Maybe we will. We'll see. Um, we've got a boss fight coming up soon, and then we can go into ultra speed. And that will soon speed up the run and then give us a bit more of an idea of what kind of direction this run is heading in. Because right now, it's still a bit all over the place. I really wouldn't mind the Dwarven Anvil, you know, happy hour kind of build. It's happy hour every hour. I haven't got a normal guillotine, so I can't add a billionaire. I've only got the guillotine essence that will behead me. Um, wealthy capture. I don't want any more geologists, I don't think. Even though I do really like the geologist build, I just... Oh my god. Have a monkey destroy a symbol that has its value increased afterwards. Let's go. Another achievement. 
We pay 777 and now we've got a boss fight. Let's get it, people. Uh, I'm going to add Oswald the Monkey Essence. Oh, imagine how much money we would have got if we had that a minute ago. We're going to take Mining Pick Essence, but I might actually disable that. Um, I'm going to take Dark Humor. Let's disable the Essence. Oh, no, that one. I might... I can't really go for a monkey build because, you know what, I can. It's just... You don't have renewable coconuts, which is the let down there, but you could definitely get them multiplied a few times, I think, to get mega money. Taking a hustling capsule over a lucky capsule. What's wrong with me? Okay, honestly, another coconut half. Yes, please. 15 stacks. It's not great, is it? Let's be real. Um, I got rid of my bounty hunter i didn't know yeah no more thieves okay oh dear it's okay we're gonna be fine i've still got loads more things i want to remove from the board i don't really like the die that much but that's okay we've got 77 gold from another free chemical sevens he's only got 187 health left easy days 117 health. Add a sapphire for the geo, even though he's not going to be around for much longer, I don't think. This needs to go. In fact, that can remove the geo for me. Oh, if it hasn't removed anything serious without me noticing. Oh, look at that. Boss is dead. Floor, bought. Floor 4 boss dead. Nice one. We're going to continue into endless. And as always, we are going to up the speed to four times. Someone said, like, why don't you leave it at, like, two or three speed? And honestly, I used to, but... When we do this, we can achieve so much more in an episode. Ah, oh, have an ore add a diamond without the help of extra machine essence. Let's go. Another achievement. We're living the life today, my friends. We really are. There goes Oswald the monkey essence. Um, I could use this to destroy all of, all of our cultists. I'm going to do it. I'm also going to take cleaning rag. We don't have to pay any money anymore, so like... I don't care if we don't make any money kind of thing. I need to remove this, I've just realised. Let's use a removal token. Get rid of the Hex of Destruction. Add a symbol, then immediately remove it to increase the value of an Eldritch creature. What? I don't know. Um, we take it though. We take it. Nice. Uh, <laughs> okay. Yeah, nice one. Um, so it does eat hexes as well. So I need to remember that. So I might add a Highlander just for the sake of it. Ah, it gives one gold for each hex or cultist or witch removed or destroyed. Okay. That I did not know. So you can actually manually remove it and still get the stack for it. Very nice. Okay, let's let's start to disable some of these things. Bro, I've got all the cat essences already. Like... Do you know what I mean? They just sat there waiting for me to use them. But obviously, I'm not going to add that many cats. Okay, so what are we doing? At the minute, we're just getting rid of all the cultists using the hex, I think. And that's kind of it. We got two diamonds from ores. I think that's thanks to the lucky carrot situation or the golden carrot situation. I can add any hex I want because they'll get eaten by the eldritch. Maybe we get a full board of eldritches. And I, but I am pretty positive there's no essence that improves the value of an eldritch apart from rusty gear essence our oh, conveyor belt yes so maybe this just isn't going to be a guillotine essence run maybe that's just the reality that i've got to live up to you know got to own up to it maybe this is going to be a normal run which it doesn't feel right after the two last previous runs that we've had but it is what it is Oh, let's go have a big ore. Add two sapphires during a spin. Bro, we're getting so many achievements. Oh, you love to see it. Keep forgetting I can add hexes. So I need to add more hexes. Um, another removal capsule as well. Okay, another golden arrow. Let's do it. Removal tokens. What am I going to get rid of this time? I think the jellyfish needs to go. I think the ninja needs to go. And I honestly think that the cat should go now. Okay. Uh, we're going to take Telescope Essence, but I'm going to turn it off. I'm going to take Dwarven Anvil Essence, but I'm going to leave it activated. I'm going to take the Mine and Jack-O-Lantern. Okay. 
we are going to take a removal capsule. Dwarven Anvil Essence would increase the value of the Dwarf. Which I think is what I want. Removal capsule. Okay, nice. We can remove some more things now if we wanted to. Like what? I couldn't tell you. Maybe the bear. Maybe the hooligan. Maybe the monkey. Now the monkey's two times its value. Uh, the die. The die. Yeah, the die's gone. Thank God. It was time for the die to go. Let's be real of ourselves. Okay, nice. The dwarf's now had its value increased 1.5 times. Good. I've seen more essences than I guess at this point, which is where rolling fast comes like this. I should have added more hexes. I keep adding coconuts. Curse Katana Essence. Obviously, I'm going to disable it. Uh, lockpick. I actually like lockpick. So we can add some safes and stuff now. Just removed like a bunch of you. Why am I re-rolling? Oh, so I can't skip because I've got goddamn hex of hoarding on the board. That needs to be removed um, by an Eldritch. I could do it manually, but I'd rather just the Eldritch do it. Although it's going to take him about a week to do by the looks of it. It's a very busy board. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to add a save. We've got a lockpick now. See how long it takes to get lockpicked. Okay. Yeah, I'm not really sure. This is a bit of a weird one. Uh, I think... Oh, there's another bartender. I might have to go this route. I've got, you know, bartender things. I might just have to. I'm going to re-roll. If I find another bartender here, I might just add like 20 bartenders. Just let him cause absolute chaos. Yeah, no. Um, we'll take the Undertaker. I've got a removal token. I'm going to get rid of the Hooligan. Okay, Essence Capsule. I really don't know if this is worth it. I think I'm slowly transitioning to a Dwarf build, I think. Or a Drinks build, or whatever you want to call it. We have got Eldritches though, so I can still add hexes if I want to. Let's risk a hex of destruction. It just removed an oyster. That's not good. Um, I'd rather add wine for the dwarf, to be honest. Wait. Have a hex of destruction trigger three spins in a row. I was about to say, I swear it just removes our wine. Is our dwarf also gone? Oh, I've got pizza cat essence now as well. I've just also added something by accident. I think it was a witch. But our dwarf's gone. We don't have a dwarf to drink the beverages. <laughs> uh, essence capsule. I don't want wine. We've got no dwarf to drink it. Hex of Midas. Yeah, this is bad. Another hex of destruction. Oh. Golem. I think I saw a golden coin get added. I hope not. Big ore. Okay. This is just... Have a hex of Midas trigger three times in a row. Oh, I've got coin and a string, haven't I? The item, luckily. That's removing all the gold. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Or a lot more sense anyway. I'm gonna add a time, I'm gonna risk a time capsule. I think it just added or uh definitely popsicle essence, nori the rabbit essence, birdhouse essence, some re-rolls, looking for probably another bartender, comfy pillow, okay. I've added wine. I don't have a dwarf. I need a dwarf to drink the wine. Okay, I have just noticed there's a martini down there and we can't drink martinis because I have a dame on the board. Although I could put a dame on the board because then the dame would drink the martinis and multiply the the gems that we've got on the board, like the diamonds and that. I don't know if that's a worthwhile thing to do, to be honest. Like we don't need money at this point. It's all about just building a nice fun build. I think I do just want bartenders. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Essence capsules. Yeah, we just need essences now, don't we? We just need a lot of them. I don't really know. I don't know if we're at a good point. I'm a little bit scared. Hex of emptiness. Yeah, we'll take that so the Eldritch can eat it. Now, obviously, if we add more Eldritches... They actually spawn in with the same amount of stacks. Like they share stacks. So that could be quite good, to be honest. Uh, anthropology degree essence, absolutely. Even though I have removed literally everything. I've added another bartender. I've added sunglasses. Okay. Um, 
I think I've removed all the people. I'm just going to disable all these anyway, to be honest. Like, we're not probably not going to use them. Uh, I've got Popsicle Essence, but what am I going to use that for? I will never know. Chemical 7. Okay. <laughs> I thought about adding wine, but once again, still no dwarf. I think I may have to take some tedium capsules and reroll for a dwarf. Or disable golden carrot, maybe. Okay. Sunglasses is going to start adding a removal token every spin because we're above four. So that's quite useful for certain things. I am thinking about adding a dame. I should have added Hex of Thievery there. Okay, I said I was going to re-roll for... Well, I'm going to take Clear Sky because it's rare. <laughs> I did think about Cardboard Box. Um, yeah, no, I need to change this. I've added a big urn, but I've removed the hooligans. Like, I'm just... I'm misplaying a lot right now because I don't think I'm paying too much attention uh the ruby can't really have a lot done with it i'm going to remove the martinis the emeralds aren't very good to be fair the diamonds aren't that good either i'm going to get rid of the highlander i'm not really adding any coconuts anymore so i'm going to risk it and get rid of the monkey look at the amount of goddamn wine on the board thanks to the bartenders i need a dwarf really badly need a dwarf hex of destruction he destroys something oh no <laughs> This is a scary time. I have to add one of these. I'm just going to add Sand Dollar and then remove Sand Dollar. That needs to go. I think it just activated again. It did. Okay, we're going to add a Hooligan and then I will be removing the Hooligan again. Ritual Candle Essences. Shrine Essence. Tortoise in the Hair Essence. That was a Frozen Fossil and I've just rolled past it. That could have been our second Eldritch. It's okay. We'll get one. Oh, let's go. Have a Hex of Hoarding. Trigger three spins in a row. Look at us. Although I now have no removal tokens, so Sunglasses is no longer proccing. I can't add any coconuts because I got rid of the monkey. I think we've got to turn Golden Carrot off, um, to be honest. Is that going to help me now find common symbols again? Doesn't look like it. I think I did add a guillotine. No, I, oh, I did. Okay, so I can add the billionaire. That's fine. Yes, look at this. Common symbols. Give me a dwarf. I had a time capsule instead. Okay. Oh, there's a dwarf. Okay, please just drink up all the wine in the world. There's another bartender. There's instant ramen. Let's get it. Okay, I actually think maybe this is the way to go. Just full on bartenders. Okay, cultists can get eldritch. That's fine. I mean, they'll get eldritch at some point at least. Could have had another oyster there, but I think we're going to get rid of our friend, the geologist, pretty soon. Even though he's on 117 stacks. See, this guy to drink a bit more wine um, and beer. Just drink everything, please. Another billionaire. I'm actually going to get another chemical seven. Oh, no, I should get billionaires. I think it's an achievement to behead so many billionaires. I'm going to get Mobius Strip Essence and Watering Can Essence, and I'll obviously disable all of those. Devil's Deal and then Looting Glove and I'm just going to disable literally everything there. So I don't accidentally click on this. Okay, another Hex of Hoarding. Brilliant. That's just going to ruin my life again, isn't it? I think. Probably. Okay, we're still not making enough money though. We definitely need some more essences. Come on, we haven't had... We don't have the Happy Hour item yet either, I don't think, which would be quite good. Or the Dwarven Anvil item. I think we've only had the essences. Um, so that could be quite important. Add a sapphire for the geologist, I guess. Look how clean the board is right now. We've got 16 symbols on the board. I quite like this. And a lot of them, like, I really don't need, you know. So I'm just looking for bartenders. No, thank you. Don't mind me. Oh, lucky carrot. Yeah, we'll add it. I'm going to have to disable it, though. I'm going to take... Uh... That does help with this, to be honest. But I'm going to take booster pack and just... I'm just going to disable it. I could probably turn golden carrot back on now as well. Because we actually only really need more bartenders, maybe. Although, do I also want more dwarfs? Oh, bartender straight away. Look at that. I think I might want a few more dwarfs, to be honest, as well. Because, you know, several dwarfs drinking the same bottle of wine. That's going to be more money. There's a second eldritch. We'll do for now when it helps with a bit of money. No more diamonds. That would have given us four. Maybe cleaning rag essence, rusty gear essence on the diamonds. 
There is. Oh, I've got to go third Eldritch. I was going to go billionaire for the challenge, but third Eldritch. Can't say no to third Eldritch. They're not really worth a lot, are they? Lucky dice essence. Cardboard box essence. I'll take void party. And I will also take barrel of dwarfs, but I'll try not to activate it immediately. Go disable these two essences. Another bartender. Okay, we may actually need a dame on here just to drink martinis and multiply diamonds. Another bartender. Okay, I'm going to make the executive decision. It's time for the geologist to go at 131 stacks. I apologize. And it might honestly be time for the Eldritches to go soon. Ah, the diamond just for the fun of it. Won't last very long. So yeah, I need a dame. <laughs> I, I, need a, I need a dame. Another Eldritch, bro. I just said I was going to get rid of the Eldritches. Now I'm adding more. If I had more dwarfs to drink more wine would be quite good. But the dame's here and the dame is going to drink the things I don't want to drink. Which are the martinis. <laughs> Bowling ball. Acquired. Goldilocks acquired. Uh, don't actually need to cancel those. They weren't essences. Let's get those martinis drank, please, dame. Ah, oh, there is another one. I could have added another one. I don't want to add too many. Uh, item capsule. Didn't roll it. Okay. Lucky capsule. Frying pan. Hex of destruction. It's got to be... Do I actually want to... I'm going to get frozen fossil, but I don't know if this is something that I want to do. Do I want to just keep adding more... Eldritches? Or do I want to keep adding more bartenders? Or... I could add another golden arrow, you see. I'm going to go Hex of Thievery. We're on 30 symbols right now, but I feel like a lot of them are removable, like drinkable. We'll get Clear Sky Essence. We'll get Devil's Deal Essence. I will actually add a martini just for the dame to drink. Okay, Lucky Capsule. I don't know. I'm stuck. I'm in a really difficult position. I've added ore, even though I don't have a goddamn geologist anymore i think i'm gonna have to start getting rid of things there's a few more there's loads of wine i might need to get i might need to pull out the seven dwarfs barrel you know thinking about it do you think we get rid of the eldritches now do you think we commit to it i think we commit to it i think we commit to a full-on bartender build after this rent window i just want to see what we get at the end of this rent window but i do think we commit to it i'm gonna say yes to comfy pillow again Card shark, honey. Okay, we're going to get anthropology degree. We're going to get protractor. That's nice. And I am now going to commit to it. Goodbye, Eldritches. Oh, I've only got two removal tokens. Okay, maybe not not quite yet. Um, maybe soon. <laughs> I'll get a few more removal tokens. Essence capsule is always good fun. Okay, this one's a little bit more messy than the previous two videos, but we're getting somewhere, I think. Just need to keep going. Oh, I've almost added that frozen fossil out of habit there. Uh, a billionaire. Yeah, you can get beheaded. Thanks, mate. I can't wait until we get that achievement done. Like, behead a million billionaires, whatever it is. A billion billionaires. Oh, that would take me a while. I'd be, like, streaming for, like, a few years straight, I think, to get that. See, the bartenders have chemical sevens as well, so we should be making loads of money just from those, but obviously nowhere near enough to... Um, nowhere near enough to... What's the word? Take us to a billion. I need to disable that. Not that I'm ever going to activate any of these, but... If I added a hex now, I almost added a hex then. Okay. Oh, mega chest has been lockpicked. Nice. Another item capsule whenever we roll it. No more diamonds. They're going to go soon as well. They don't really want the dame, to be honest, but somebody, somebody's got to drink the martinis. Do I add seven dwarves? I feel like that's not a smart thing to do. Uh, we'll, we'll have a look. We'll have a look later on. Okay, I don't want any of those. I will take a capsule machine and I will actually take a piggy bank. I've got one removal token. I might just save it. I might try and get four again for sunglasses. What do you think? Wouldn't be a bad idea, would it? We need some kind of constant removal token input. Although, will we actually? I feel like we've got... Because we've got something to deal with the, the martinis. You know, we've got the dame. It's not too bad. There's not going to be really a lot. We have to manually remove, if anything. 
Another bartender. I've added it. Ah, oh, we're on six removal tokens now. That should start to go up one every turn. It is. Okay, nice. Well, let's get rid of... Oh, let's do this first. We'll get Jackalite and Essence and Ninja Mouse Essence. Reroll this. Looking for a bartender. Okay, no. I'll take Chicken Coop. I'll take Happy Hour. Let's go. Disable these two Essences. Removal tokens. Goodbye, Eldritches. That takes us to 21 symbols. That's not going to last long, is it? Another bartender. Okay, we're on eight. I'm going to get rid of the diamonds. That now takes us to 20. Yeah, look. Empty spaces. Okay, so we just want conveyor belt essence. I think we've got normal conveyor belt. Let me just check. Um, yeah, we've got normal conveyor belt. So it's just the essence that we need then. That will increase the chance of the bartenders adding beverages even more. Not great numbers though. I need more multipliers. That's why I'm thinking about the... I've still got pearls on the board. Oh my god. They've been taking up most of the spaces then. Yeah, they have. Okay, I think it's time for seven dwarves, my friends. What do you think? I think it's got to be. After this rent payment? Yeah. Reroll this, looking for more bartenders. Okay, oil can. That will get disabled. Swapping device. That's getting disabled. Okay, barrel of dwarves is everybody. There's all our dwarves. Do we have anthropology degree essence? Because that would be a good time to activate it right now. Where was it? Was it on the last page already? There it is. It's going to happen twice because of popsicle essence, I think. Yes, look at that. Okay, it's starting people. 3.4 times their value. Nice. Nice. Okay, happy days. That's better, isn't it? See a few more essences now to improve that even more. This mega chest also needs to get lockpicked pretty quickly. I am keeping the gold arrows for the time being just because they're fun. I could add another one. That takes us to 25 symbols though. But maybe I don't need that many. I definitely need this many dwarves. Or this many. No, I don't need this many dwarves. Because we only need a few dwarves, right? I'm thinking in my head. We don't need a lot of stuff because... Um, or a lot of people, I should say. Because we've already got a lot. Like, I don't need eight dwarves, eight bartenders. I think anthropology only needs eight. The essence does. And we've got, like, what? How many is that? I don't know. Is that eight on their own? Eight, one, and I think nine. So we could narrow the board down quite a lot. We've got to keep a dame around just to drink those martinis. So what do you think we cull down on? I think it might have to be the dwarves, you know. I think we properly bring down the price of the, or the price, the amount of the dwarves. I think that's the vibe. Okay, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. And then, because we'll still get Anthropology Degree Essence on the bartenders. But then, does that apply, like, proactively to the ne next things we add? Or retroactively, whatever. Okay, I'm going to get Dishwasher, yes. I'm going to get Fruit Basket. Dishwasher adds an Essence token every... How many spins is it? 12. So that's nice. That's going to help me find more essences, hopefully. I wish there was like a... I could probably get a few of these later on. So I think you can get multiples of the same item now. So that wouldn't be too bad. Okay. Let's have a look real quick. We're on 22 symbols with a bottle of wine. Let's just get rid of like four dwarfs. Takes us to 18 symbols when the bartenders are going to add things and... There's another bartender. So we've got one empty space right now. We should narrow it down again. We could go all the way back to one dwarf, to be honest. But... Oh, I know what we need to do. We need to do 20, 20 dwarfs. <gasps> we need to do 20 dwarfs, one bartender. That's what we should be doing, but on like a telescope essence. Oh no, a telescope run. Not a telescope essence run. Do we have a normal protractor? We do. That's only the corners, though. We need a normal telescope, don't we? I don't think we have normal telescope yet. No, we've got telescope essence over here. I want to keep that disabled. So we just need the normal telescope. And then I think... I actually think that's the way to go. So maybe I've kind of killed this a little bit. Um, I could just add another bartender right now. 
I'm going to take an essence capsule instead. Yeah, is that what I want to do? I feel like it is what I want to do, right? I want them all to drink the same wine. But then how do they get multiplied? I guess just their multiplier, their, their anvil multiplier or their rusty gear multiplier or anthropology degree essence. Okay, let's start working towards that. Let's start working towards getting like 19 dwarfs, one bartender or something similar, you know? I'm going to have to turn the luck things off. I don't want to turn golden carrot, lucky carrot, etc. off until we've gotten the telescope. Which is like the most important part of the build at this point, if we want it all to work. So telescope every four spins makes everything. Oh, let's go rusty gear essence. Makes everything um, adjacent to each other. Okay, I'm just gonna disable all these as always. Didn't really get what we wanted there, did we? I should have thought about rusty gear essence because it's only multiplied the bartenders and not the dwarfs because there wasn't that many dwarfs. I should have saved that. It's okay. Come on. Essence capsule. Yes. Just give me essence capsules. That's all I want. That's all I need. Just essences. Let me find more essences. More dwarf essences. No more golden arrows, man. They're going to be gone soon. We've already got three on the board. That's enough. I mean, we're on 171,000, so we're nowhere near the billion total, but we can get there with just a few changes. Okay. I'm going to say yes to this. I'm looking for... You know what I actually need? I do actually need... Um, <gasps> Dwarven Anvalescence. Let's go. No, thank you. I actually need the... I'm going to have Barrel of Dwarfs again. Um, I need Comfy Pillow Essence. I'm not sure if I added it again and then disabled it again. No, I don't think I did. I think we used it and then we haven't re-added it since. I could do with it again. <laughs> That's our best way of finding a very rare item at the minute. I think I'm going to go ahead and add these dwarves now. Which takes us to 31. And then I'm just going to go ahead and start getting rid of some bartenders. That leaves us with three bartenders. But if this guy, yeah, can drink the martinis and stuff. Dwarven Anvil Essence has just been activated. They're all at 5.1 times their value. Now that's a lot better. Always oh, had a hustling capsule. you got to collect those pool balls. See how many pool balls you get at the end of the run. We've got it for 292,000. Is that just from this? Maybe. I could add another golden arrow. You know, I might do it. I might just do it and start narrowing this down to one. And then I might manually remove Martini every time he adds it. But there's only going to be one bartender. So we're hardly going to see that. Oh my God. Another golden arrow. Okay, we're down to one bartender. Just need this dame to drink the Martinis. And then, and then what will happen is we'll start replacing the golden arrows for dwarves. Okay, yeah, nice. We added a chemical seven of all things. Do you think we should remove the geologist or the, the dame? Not yet, but we should, right? Quickly, the wolf essence. That was the only one we had, only essence token. I'll take chili powder and water in can. Oh, wait, that was our second chili powder. I think maybe we're starting to get the same items again. I know what we need, and it's that telescope, and we're not really getting it. We're going to need, like, the bottle of wine or whatever to be in the corner on a protractor run for it to work which is kind of insane to think about actually unless we get telescope of course add a billionaire watch you get beheaded it's always fun yeah thank you very much R removal capsule not really sure we need any of those we're on 60 now <laughs> 62 um yeah i'm gonna get rid of you soon i've seen more dwarfs to add first so i just want to add all the dwarfs get rid of the golden arrows just add dwarfs so dwarves bartender and then like an empty spot i think and i think that's it that would be the dream uh, i'm gonna keep saying yes to this but i do feel like i'm getting similar things from it yeah i am okay i disable that i can disable that and actually i'm gonna disable it this time disable all the essences my friends 
So I might have to stop saying yes to comfy pillow and I might have to wait until we get a comfy pillow essence again until I say yes because we're just getting the same rare items every single spin without failure. So let's go to comfy pillow and turn it off and let's wait until we get a comfy pillow essence because that guarantees a very rare item which then could be the telescope. I just want to check. I'm pretty sure we don't have the telescope. Uh, we've got telescope essence which is there yeah no we definitely don't have the item okay we got protractor though so that's i mean it's not as good but it, it'll work with protractor you know we might get lucky along the way and get a bottle of wine in a corner with on a protractor spin and then that would cause chaos so maybe it's just a matter of playing and finding out now i almost add an eldritch every time we had like five eldritches and i'm addicted to them again I would have loved to have done an Eldritch run, by the way, but this one just seemed more appropriate at the time. Okay, at least the martini got drank straight away. We're up to 338,000. This is obviously making a bit more money than anything else was. Another golden arrow. I'll take it. I'll take X-ray machine as well. I'll also take tax evasion. Okay. See, three new items there that we haven't seen before or we haven't taken before. So that's good. Added, well, I've added a tedium capsule. Added to find more dwarfs, maybe. That couldn't be a bad shout. Or do you think we just wait until we find uh, a thing again? What's it called? Oh, there's one. Nice. Okay. Um, does we now need to remove something? So maybe it's the time to get rid of all the golden arrows. I think it might be. Although I do like the way they multiply each other a lot. So I might just get rid of the I'm gonna get rid of the dame and I'm gonna manually remove any martinis that get added. Okay, there's one that's been added already. Oh well, that horrifies me how quick that was. Maybe I will still need a dame. Okay, so the plan is now whenever we see a dwarf, we add it in replacement of the gold arrow. But I need to disable the look. Um modifiers again so we can find common symbols i think that's it to be honest okay give me essences rusty gear essence anthropology degree essence um dwarven anvil essence happy hour essence any of those please that would be great um also wouldn't mind conveyor belt essence just to make this guy add more often that'd be quite good so we've only got conveyor belt there's rusty gear essence Destroys itself to seven dwarfs removed. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Um, we're going to take happy hour essence. Anthropology degree essence. Let's go. We're going to take checkered flag and flush. Okay, I obviously want all three of these to activate. So we haven't got popsicles. So I only can activate once. But there we go. 11 times their value now for the dwarfs. Just need them to drink a beverage three times to activate happy hour essence. That shouldn't be too bad. Up to 1.2 million. That's already a big improvement. We're still a far, far, far away from a billion. But a few more of those essences. And we can do it. Just gotta believe. Just gotta believe. What's that from? Is that Lucio from Overwatch? Maybe. If I confuse that with a different voice line. I know he says like you've got the rhythm, but come on, people. I I believe. Um for about adding a removal capsule there, but no, chemical seven instead. Even though I don't need one. Have one more drink and then happy hour essence gets activated and all that does, that will multiply the beverage a little bit more. So then the beverage becomes more valuable, which means the money that the dwarf makes from the beverage is a little bit more valuable. Yeah, and it gets quite nice. I'm not adding that, I'll add fifth ace essence though. I'll add red suits and I'll add, I feel like I've already got a lemon. I don't. Okay, I'll add a lemon then. Nice. Disable these guys, especially Lucky Carrot and the Pepper, because they're the essences that get activated really easily. <gasps> I've got to disable the Martini. There is a beer on the board. So this could activate Happy Hour Essence. There we go. Nice. There's another dwarf there, which I did say I was going to add more dwarfs and get rid of the golden arrows. So let's do that. Okay. I like this. I like this a lot. I feel like I do need telescope. The best way to get there is going to be comfy pillow essence. But then I need popsicle. And to find popsicle, I should probably get like... I need to use comfy pillow essence again. Don't I? 
finds very rare items, or I could just leave all my luck modifiers on. Which I don't really think is a great idea. Or we could use this. Oh, that's symbols. No, that's rare symbols. I don't care about that. Very rare symbols. Oh, no. I need very rare items. We could get it on a protractor spin, so who knows? Let's just let's see how it goes for now. Okay. Uh, holy water essence, protractor essence. I'll just disable that because we're not going to use it. Uh, tax evasion essence. Skip that. I'm going to add horseshoe. I'm going to add recycling. That's very rare. Okay, nice. We're getting somewhere, people. We're getting somewhere. We're on 2 million right now. Only like 997 million and something to go until we hit a billion, but it's still good. Give me a few more dwarfs as well, please. Oh, look at that. Gave me a dwarf. I could have added a uh, wild card at any point during this run, which would have made it even more wildly successful. But uh, I kind of like this approach that we've got right now. Oh, that just like doubled our net worth there. Um, very nice. And then like hardly anything the turn after. I suppose they don't drink anything. They're really not that valuable, are they? Kind of makes sense. Just behead a billionaire real quick. Okay, I like this recycling because we can use it to find things. Not that we need to find literally anything at the minute, apart from dwarves. So I might just use it to find that if we ever roll like a tedium capsule. Uh, I'm going to add purple pepper. I'm going to add... Barrel of Dwarves. I'm then going to use Barrel of Dwarves and I'm going to remove all the Golden Arrows and that leaves us with 22. So now I'm going to remove three Dwarves. Okay, well this is the build. We just need the big pop-off moment to happen. Oh, another Dwarf. Um, which I think is going to take a beverage but also it's going to take a lot more essences, I think. I don't think we've got the modifier like large enough yet to make you know to get us to a billion like if say if all these dwarves drink the same beverage i don't think that's enough to get us to a billion yet i think we need more modifiers which we can easily get dwarven anvil essence happy hour essence rusty gear essence anthropology degree essence and obviously comfy pillow essence is a big one so i'm just adding that telescope we needed telescope as well yes okay this is going to make everything so much easier now because as soon as the beverage is drank on a telescope spin, that's that's good money. You know, that, that is really good money. So we seem to add one now. Was that a telescope spin? It must have been. Okay, maybe it wasn't as strong as I expected it to be. Honestly, I think without Golden Arrow, we are really weak. Yeah, we are. Okay. So Golden Arrow was the one doing all the big, the big money moving. Um... So we need essences now. So we're just going to spin for days. We're going to use this. Conveyor belt would actually help them find uh, spawn beverages faster. Popsicle is a good start. I will take Popsicle. Thank you for that. Um, comfy pillow essence. I now need another comfy pillow essence <laughs> to find. Actually, I don't. We've got telescope and Popsicle now. <gasps> okay. So I guess one thing I could do, I could increase our chance to find... You know, I could enable the rarity modifiers again, the two carrots. Just to help us find, like, anything that we haven't got yet that's rare, maybe. In the item capacity. I'm not sure really what there is. Okay, I'm going to take egg carton essence and instant ramen essence and piggy bank essence. I'm going to take a wanted poster. I'm going to take cardboard box. I'm going to disable literally all of these. Even comfy pillow uh, instant ramen essence. The only one I want active right now is that conveyor belt essence. And that can happen. That can prop twice thanks to popsicle. Okay. Yeah, I need higher modifiers. <laughs> oh, we're so weak without the golden arrows. Okay, that's fine though. We'll we'll get some. I'm sure we will. We will. We'll get some more modifier increases at some point. Why have I done a wealthy capsule there? I'll actually never be able to tell you. Quantum symbol bomb essence, lint roller essence, fertilizer essence, no more bartenders. Add a fish tank. I'm going to add compost heap, but that definitely needs to be disabled. Okay. Why is that? Just add loads of seeds or whatever that we don't really need right now. 
can you believe this guy hasn't added a martini in like ages? Um, no, thank you. Egg. Yeah, no. I'm just rolling for essences at this point. We can do it. No, thank you. <laughs> I just need a bit of luck to hit where we like roll the same essence. Dwarven Anvil Essence. Yes. Okay, that's good. We'll take Barrel of Dwarfs. We will disable it. We'll take Ritual Candle. We're going to disable Max with a Bear Essence. This can proc twice because of Popsicle now. Oh, yes. Okay. Nice. I was about to say, why isn't that procking? But it did. Oh, yeah. Because some of them are... Yeah, some of them were less. Yeah, I get it now. Some of them were only like seven times before. Okay. That's amazing work. Thank you, Dwarven Anvil Essence. Now I just need other essences. I'm going to disable Barrel of Dwarfs so I can't accidentally click on it and add like seven dwarfs to the build. Okay. Just got to keep going. Just got to keep going. A few more modifiers. A few more bottles of wine. We'll get there. Uh, we'll take Nori the Rabbit. We'll take Big Symbol Bomb. Disable Big Symbol Bomb so I don't want to use it. This is kind of insane. Why am I trying this? Why am I trying to do this? <laughs> it's okay. It happens. We've got a lot of achievements today trying to get to this point though. So I am quite happy. No proud of the achievements that we're collecting without even trying, you know? There's going to become a point later down the line where we are, like, really hardcore achievement hunting. Like, right, guys, we need this. We're going to force this today. And we're going to stream for, like, a million hours until we've got it complete. Um, so I'm glad. Do I want to use Comfy Pillow Essence again? Honestly, I might get it and just disable it until I realize that I want something with it. Do you know what I mean? Frozen Pizza, that's very rare. Credit Card's very rare. I don't even think we've got the rare modifiers on. Oh, wait, I should probably turn Frozen Pizza. In fact, I'm going to turn Frozen Pizza off. I think I'm going to turn Credit Card as off as well. How often am I going to add things? I'm only going to add beer or wine, aren't I? Which this thing adds anyway, so... I'm going to disable Comfy Pillow Essence, yeah. Okay, so we just want Essences then. <laughs> we just want Essences. We need Capture Machine, maybe, and then just like those Essence Capsules. Have we not got a Capture Machine? I feel like we should have one. I don't think we do though. I'll find out next time we add any kind of capsule. Uh, Lefty the Rabbit Essence. Dwarven Anvil Item. Hello. How have we not received that yet before just now? Um. <laughs> oh, also, someone told me I should just turn, turn Lucky Sevens off because that saves a bit of time when spinning. So we're going to do that. I don't want to turn it to instant, you see, because instant is actually like really hard to watch. I already get that this is hard to watch, but instant is really hard to watch. Right, Dwarven Anvil is going to help a little bit with the values, but we're still nowhere near where we need to be. Okay, we must have Capsule Essence because that's added two of those. I think we're actually miles away, you know, we're, we're getting hardly any money. We need it to be... Oh, okay. Um, will this remove them before a spin? I think I need to add this and then disable it quickly. Uh, we'll get Shrine. Okay, let's immediately disable all of these things. Yes. Okay, we've still got all our dwarves. That's good. Uh, a billionaire can get beheaded. That's fine. Yeah, not... Oh, no, they've added a martini. That's the first time they've done that for a while. What's our highest dwarf right now? 26 times value? Yeah, man. We need, like... What were the cats the other day? You know, like 100 million times value. This could be, like, a two-hour episode, my friends. If we're really going to go through with this. Which I think we might. Nice. Wine. Drank. Let's go. Popping off right now. Wine drank again. Yeah, we we're getting like 100k per bottle of wine. We need like 10 mil per bottle of wine, like at least. Um, like I've already got all of those. Um, I should disable that as well. Okay. Don't need an oyster anymore. There, that phase is gone. Essence capsule. I do need essence capsules. I need essence tokens galore. So I can find more essences to help with this. What's the biggest multiplier? Do they all do the same? I feel like Rusty Gear is like what? 
is it three times? Is it even three times rusty gear? It might not even be that. It might be like 1.5 times. Um, okay, I'm gonna take popsicle essence. I don't think I can turn it off, but <gasps> okay, it's gotta yeah, it is 1.5 times, but it's gonna have to be this. I think for now, I really want both, but rusty gear essence, anthropology degree essence as well. That's such a good combo to get at the same time. Okay, let's disable. Oh, we got popsicle essence. I Apparently, this doesn't stack, which I didn't know until the previous video. Okay, 58 times now. 130 times. Okay, so we see them all to drink a bottle of wine on a telescope spin. I think, yeah. There's no beverage on the board. Right, can this guy add a beverage? He's added a beer. And let's go telescope spin. Was that 600,000? I think it was only 600,000. <laughs> um, right, we got to get more essences then, my friends. This. I'm going to take this. I don't think I can disable it, but I also don't think it's going to get used. So it's fine. Um, yeah, you can't disable. I can disable that though for sure, even though we haven't got any rabbits. So all this does now, if I was to add a symbol five times, we would then lose that pizza essence. Because I'm not adding any symbols, it shouldn't really get used up. The essence shouldn't get consumed, so it should stay there forever, I hope. Um, although I am going to add essence capsules and stuff at certain times, but at least it takes another essence out of the essence pool for now, you know, until I do add enough things. Like I've added a beer there, that's going to obviously go towards one of them. Yeah, I think we've got 400,000 for a beer, unless I'm mistaken. And I think it's 600,000 for wine. Okay, essence capsule, go on. Give us two essence tokens. Item capsule, we're still adding items we don't have yet. Okay. Um, I'm nervous. Let's get lemon essence. Let's get four leaf clover essence, dwarven anvil essence. Uh, white pepper essence, coin on a string essence. Okay, so there's a few we can disable there. Uh, we want obviously want to keep dwarven anvil essence, you know, alive. Um, so whenever they drink something now, they'll get multiplied again, and it should happen twice because of course you've got popsicle. Here we go, 195 times their value. That rolled 1.1 million, and it should happen again. There we go, 292 times. Okay. Okay, we're getting somewhere now. We still need a few more, but we're getting somewhere. This needs to get into the thousands. <laughs> and then obviously, it's only on a telescope spin. It's not like a sunflower where you can get clear sky and then all of a sudden, the suns and the flowers are adjacent every single spin for the rest of their lives. Uh, you actually have to wait for the telescope spin and then hope that a beverage gets added on that spin. But still, it's not you know too low of a chance, is it? It's not that bad. Um... Okay, we'll take fish tank essence. We'll take recycling essence. We'll take brown pepper essence. Okay, no essence is there that I wanted, but that's fine. Um, I'll just disable all of these and even egg carton. I don't want to lose anything. Um, although you don't actually lose egg carton, so I suppose it's fine. I'm not going to add any eggs, though. Um, <laughs> I'm going to try not to. I might accidentally add one just out of habit now because I know that I've got an egg carton. I think we're going to be fine. I don't really need to add any beverages. I just need to add essence tokens. Not beverages, sorry. Any symbols. I will probably add a few beverages because they're always helpful. I'm going to add billionaires because it goes towards the total amount of billionaires beheaded, which I'm hoping is going to be a heck of a lot by the time we complete every single achievement on this game, which is 777 wins, by the way. Um, you know, that's like 777 episodes unless we stream, you know, do some marathon streams and stuff. But yeah, okay. Treasure map, Ricky the banana. Uh, we'll take Ricky the banana essence, happy hour essence, conveyor belt essence. I'm actually gonna let proc. Uh, we're gonna take swear jar and small symbol bomb. I'm not gonna let anything out. Actually, yeah, no, I want those to activate. Happy hour essence that can activate twice. That's gonna increase the value of the beverages that the dwarfs drink. So that's useful. It just takes, I think, three beverages to be drank for it to activate the first time. Okay, and obviously I do want um, our friend the conveyor belt essence to proc as well, just to increase the chance of adding a beverage for the bartender. I think it's probably be close to 100% by the time it actually does proc, but... 
I'm add why am I adding Huston capsules still? I'm addicted to Huston capsules. I actually just can't stop collecting them. Another billionaire to behead. Let's go. We must have beheaded like 10 this game at least. That's quite a good amount to add to the collection. That was 1.3 million on a beer. I like to see that. Chicken coop essence. None of those. Grey pepper. White pepper. Oh, we've already got a grey pepper. Okay, so it looks like we're starting to re-add some of the older items I've already got. Interesting. Okay. Just the essences though, isn't it? That's all I really care about. I couldn't care less about um, items <laughs> at this point. I think we've got all the items that we need. It is just essences. Okay, this looks like it needs to drink one more beverage to proc again. So can we add a beverage, please, bartender? There we go. Nice. Okay. That was, I think... 2 million up to 18 million in the bank right now obviously we need a billion to be beheaded so we're still quite a way away uh we will actually take popsicle essence again rusty gear essence come on coin on a string mobius these i feel like we've added a lot of these before you know now rusty gear essence should happen twice here because we've got popsicle although popsicle essence doesn't stack okay 657 times their value now on the biggest dwarfs That'll be interesting to see where that gets us with a bottle of wine and a telescope spin. I think a beer just got us 4 million. A few more, you know. We're not too far away now because once the numbers get bigger, the multiplier just obviously increases massively. Reroll capsule. I had a few. I don't need those. Why am I adding reroll capsules? Um, oh dear. Okay, essence capsule is what we need in this life. Yes, please. Uh, we'll take Undertaker Essence. We'll take Flush Essence. We'll take Oswald the Monkey Essence. Coin on a string again. Yeah, we're getting the same symbols now. Okay. Still getting a few new essences, though. So there's obviously still a lot of essences, you know, in the pool that aren't the ones that we want yet, which is it's good to know. We're not quite there yet. So we'll soon know once we start, you know, getting the repeat essences every single spin, as opposed to every like 10 spins or 10 rent windows, I guess. I'm feeling good about it though. We've got a lot of... Uh, it's going to be good once we complete this. This is quite a nice build, I think, to have done. Um, I do kind of just feel like going through all the builds and making them endless to the point where you get guillotine just by forcing essences. Like, we could have done this with geologists, but I feel like that's, that would take a long time. Uh, shedding season essence. Very big symbol bomb essence. Anthropology degree essence. Yes. Okay, I'm going to go... Cardboard box. See, we're getting a lot of things now that I've already had. Like cardboard box. 985 times their value. 1,478 times their value. Yes, we're up to 48 million. Come on. This is getting better and better. This is going to be so satisfying. That conveyor belt essence is finished as well. So this guy should have like pretty much close to 100% chance now. I think he's had like five conveyor belt essence procs. As well as the conveyor belt items. So... You better be adding one every single spin. It looks like he is as well. I think that was 14 million. Oh, yeah, we're going to do it. Look, we're already on 82 million. This is it. I think another essence, and then, then it's going to be pretty much over. Uh, we'll take compost heap essence. That's the only one we've got. We'll take ritual candle. We'll take black suits. So, yeah, all the items are the same. No new items. It's only essences. Ooh. It's getting exciting. He's actually getting really exciting. Item capsule. Oh, I did a black pepper. Okay, so there is clearly a new item there that we haven't already got. The black pepper. I'm not going to add any more chemical sevens. Even though I could, but I think I've disabled it to speed the spins up a little bit. 93 million. So I think wine on a telescope spin is 14 million. I think that's what we just got. So I'm quite happy with that, to be honest. And I think beer on a non-telescope spin is 1 million. Beer on a telescope spin is... How much was that? I don't know. Oh, Rusty Gear Essence. Yes. Yes. Okay. They're going to get multiplied again. Are you ready for this? <laughs> and they multiply twice. 2,217 times their value. 3,325 times their value. Up to 132 million. Give me a wine on a telescope spin. Was that like, how much was that? I didn't see. I don't know if that was a lot. <laughs> it spins a little bit too quick. I might have to turn the speed down just to have a look. Um, I think that was 21 million for a beer. 
thought it would have been a lot higher than that, to be honest, by now. It's cool. We are like, what, a fifth of the way to a billion. And we're about to get there a lot faster now that we've got essences. Come on, just a few, like one more essence, I think, maybe. We just... Oh, we, ha we didn't have conveyor belt item. No, we must have it to repeat, isn't it? Yeah, it's a repeat. Okay. So does that stack if you get a repeat item now? Because that'd be really good if it did. Because we could increase, you know, you could get more dwarven anvils and stuff. Okay, we're officially over a fifth of the way there to a billion. We're almost there, people. I just need essences. Please. We just need one, really. Rusty Gear, Anthropology, Dwarven Anvil. Any of those will do. Any of those essences will do. Just need a bit of luck. Almost at 300 million already, to be fair. Uh, this isn't going to take much longer, my friends. I think we've done it, to say the least. Which is nice. It's a nice achievement. Oh, Happy Hour Essence, that'll do. We'll take Popsicle Essence. Yeah, no, no big beverage ones there, but it's okay. Or no big dwarf ones there. Sorry, we did get a beverage one. Obviously, we got Happy Hour. Um, just need them to drink the beverages. So stop spawning chemical sevens, please. Okay. That's going to multiply the beverages even more, but I feel like the beverages aren't really that. Actually, I don't know. The base value, there's still quite a lot because obviously these guys multiply whatever the, the beverage is. So adding a few to the beverages, like adding, a, you know, several thousand to the total spin. I think we just got 72 million then from a spin, I think. We're on 426 now, almost halfway to a billion. So, I think, I think we're going to be safe. And there's Dwarven Anvilescence, and that will probably do it, to be honest. Dwarven Anvilescence, just need them to drink a beverage, and they'll get multiplied twice again. So, 4,900 and, where is it? 88 times their value. Here we go. 7,482 times their value. We're up to 632 million. Okay. Just need, I think... Do we still need another essence, do you reckon? It's crazy because this... Like, by this point now with the cats, you're on like several hundred thousand times value because it multiplies by 13 each time. We are on 900 and something million. So I'm going to turn the speeds down to one. So we can watch the final reckoning. We need 100 mil. Probably we'll get it off one spin if we have wine on a telescope spin. There's wine. I don't think it's a telescope spin. Look how slow it goes. Oh my God. Look how slow it goes. That's not even a telescope spin, is it? 35 million. That's a telescope spin. It's on beer. Are we going to get 70 mil or 61 mil we need? We are. Let's go. Guillotine Essence free achievement unlocked. Oh, that's bubbled up on your screen. Yeah, it will in a second. Just the screen goes black whenever we get Guillotine Essenced. Come on. Oh, is it, is it broke? There we go. Achievement unlocked. Be destroyed by Guillotine Essence three times. Only another 74 time, more times to go. We, we did it again today with a completely different build, which is nice. And it was a fun one as well. Pretty cool bartender build. 19 or 18 dwarfs, one bartender is uh pretty satisfying but yeah thank you all for watching today thank you all for supporting the recent videos let me know what run i should do next i'm not really trying to force anything i'm just trying to the only thing i am forcing is like a new build every day i don't want to do obviously like another uh sunflower build straight away or another cat build and obviously cultist was there today we could have done cultists to be honest because the same sort of thing anthropology rusty gear but they don't drink any wine but then their base value is higher so they also don't have dwarven and like a dwarven anvil equivalent uh essence that actually would have taken longer i think if we did cultists and as for geologists i, d I feel like you're gonna have you gonna have to get their stacks up to like a thousand and then do the same thing with anthropology degree essence and rusty gear essence because they don't have any essence that actually affects a geologist like that that's okay um thank you all for watching today's video let me know what you think in the comments down below or message me on Twitter or Discord or something. I'm trying to, you know, interact with people more. I'm really enjoying it the last few days and I want, it, I want to keep enjoying it. And I think a big part of it is I'm replying to every comment and I'm just playing new stuff and we're having a good time. So let's have a chat down below. But apart from that, thank you all for watching. I will see you all again tomorrow. Goodbye.